Hi, um, I'm Enrico, and I wanted to tell you a story about how DA really helped me um, be objective and self-reflective and more self-aware um, as I was working through a personal life decision. In the early 2000s, um, I was working as a decision analysis consultant at Presswoodhouse Coopers in Sydney, Australia. And at the time, I was evaluating whether or not to do my PhD at Columbia University or the University of Sydney in Australia, which is where I lived. And I had a number of criteria. I, I had assessed um, time to degree, stipend, distance from family, um, getting a DA job afterwards as, as important objectives for me. And after assessing my own preferences and the uncertainties that, that I perceived, um, there was no way that Columbia was a, good, was a good choice. The University of Sydney was closer, paid better, um, faster, to, faster time to degree, and on criteria which were close, like getting a DA job, um, there was a great deal of uncertainty, especially around um, the job market in the United States, which I didn't know anything about. So my analysis recommended very easily that, that I should go to the University of Sydney. Yet in my heart, I really wanted to go to Columbia. I just wanted to go there. So I reflected. And I add an, addi an additional parameter, additional objective, which I call the ooh factor. I wanted people to go ooh um, when I told them where, where I went. And at first, um, this factor didn't, didn't seem to do very much. Um, the, the weighting was, was, was really strong in favor of the University of Sydney. So I ramped it up, right? It was, it was more and more important to me. Um, it was the only thing which was, which was favoring Columbia. I had to turn it up to 50 to 60 times more valuable um, than any other criteria for Columbia to be, to be a viable choice. So I became aware of my own preferences and, and this awareness led to some really strange kind of feelings for me. Um, on the one hand, I'm, I'm quite religious. So, um, and my religion, Christianity, says that pride is, is sinful, right, it's bad which I had effectively quantified my pride as 50 to 60 times more important to me than, than any other career objective. Yet, on the other hand, I also felt tremendously relieved that, that I could now make um, a decision with my eyes open. In the end, I ended up going to Columbia. In the end, nobody said ooh. Um, yet, I, I still find that self-reflection and um, um, self-awareness um, are a really valuable, a really valuable part of the DA toolkit. Um, they've been valuable, served me well when I was in consulting, now that I'm an academic again in teaching, and in other personal decisions that I've made. All right, thanks.